Hey guys, this is Yushik here, and welcome back to Pixelmon Season 3, Episode 41. We have 41 episodes in, and we have some more pixel mining to do, so let's get into this shiz. Uh, first of all, I'm gonna start off by putting this Nidor uh, King away. As cool as he is, we are not going to be using him. Instead, we are going to be uh, continuing along with trying to fill up our PCs with our living decks. We have been doing a very, very awesome do job. I mean, like, look at this. Um, I've also, I'm just gonna catch you guys up on something real quick. I went and uh, updated this board over here, which I hadn't updated in a while. So, find a Master Ball. I ticked off and catch 100 Pokemon. We actually have, I think, like exactly 100 or like 101 Pokemon. So it's pretty, it's pretty awesome that we uh, hit that milestone and we didn't even really celebrate it. So now I guess we're celebrating it now, which is uh, cool. Um, also to keep you guys a little bit updated, I don't know if you guys, if everyone saw it, but I started a new series, a dinosaur series. Um, the first episode went really, really well. It was well received by everyone. Everyone seemed to have a good time. And um, so I'm really excited to continue that series. There should be uh, a new Pixelmon series starting as well that's going to run alongside this one. So there's going to be two for you guys. And I'm also hoping, hoping that I can start a Kingdom Hearts Birth by Sleep series really, really soon. So that's four different series, uh, plus Feed the Beast whenever that comes along. There's five series I'm going to be running. And um, I'm hoping to do two videos a day. And the way my schedule I wanted to set up is Pixelmon Dino, Pixelmon Dino every day, just alternating. And then um, the second video of the day will alternate between, you know, like the new Pixelmon series, Kingdom Hearts, um, and then Feed the Beast. Pixelmon, Kingdom Hearts, Feed the Beast, etc. Whatever. So you guys get that. Um, so that's how everything, you know, but we're going to jump straight. In. Last episode, I did a lot of talk in the start. Today, we're, oh, I mean, for the, you know, for a while, we're going to just go into doing some Pixelmon. So welcome back to the series, guys. I need to figure out what's next in the Pokédex. But, um, yeah, hopefully you guys are going to enjoy this episode. Uh, if we go Pixelmon list of all obtainable Pokémon. Uh, a list should come up for us. Available Pokemon. That's the wrong website. This one. Alright. And, um, what else do we need to do? Let me just think. Oh, wait. Like, let me, let me put away this TM. I don't know when we got it, but, uh, we have a TM here. We should put this baby away. Um, okay. Hmm. Alright. So, what we wanted to do, or at least last, how many, how many, oh, oh, nearly, oh, I'm out of Ultra Balls. Right. Okay. I need more stone. That's why. Okay, we got stone here. I have no cobblestone anywhere. Let's quickly mine some cobblestone. I don't know why I have, like, none. But uh, we're going to quickly grab some, turn it into stone, turn those into buttons, and then we'll have a bunch of Ultra Balls. Because uh, we wanted to catch a legendary Pokemon. I think I asked everyone last episode... Um, uh, to to give me some suggestions for which legendary we should go for and um, I mean it, it's pretty much all over the place so we're just gonna go for anything because um, everyone wants something different um, but uh, we will hopefully catch a legendary Pokemon soon that's the, that's the plan um, but the, the the problem in that in that plan is um, that it's pretty random when they when they spawn so we have to kind of just get lucky. Um, but let's make four Ultra Balls while we're here, so at least we have something to use. And what I might also do is if we look in our PC, see if there's anything kind of like low level that might be able to do some damage but not kill something. Like Furia, that might work. Let's just bring Furia along with us. Level 24 Hound Doom, that could, that could do something. It could do enough damage, I don't know, we'll see. Um, so we got a bunch of stones being made here. We'll just leave that for now. Um, and then if I look at this website I brought up, uh, the next thing is Clefairy and Clefable. That is it. Now, that should be pretty easy because uh, Clefairy evolves with the Moonstone. So we should get... If we find two Clefairies, we should be good to go. I did see a Jigglypuff over here as well, which is also on that list. Which I don't... Do we have a Jigglypuff? Uh, no, we do not have a Jigglypuff. So, um, I know Jigglypuff is also coming up and I saw one over here, but it must have... Uh, must have despawned or something. It was it was a little bit ago. I was setting up to record and, and whatnot, but we are gonna have to find our way to Here we go. Okay, so if we go to the, if we teleport to the Savannah biome and they only spawn during the night That's it. Okay, so wait, what's next on the list? Zubat and Golbat. Now those should be pretty easy to get. We just have to go into some mines or something, you know Zubat, Golbat, uh, Oddish, Gloom, Vile, Plume Let's just see some stuff right, right here. Alright, so we need a Gloom, actually. Let's get the Gloom first, and then when it's night time, we'll get the Clefairy and stuff. So Gloom, uh, we'll teleport back home. We'll just go to the forest behind us, because they should... Gloom should spawn there. I believe so. We also have two new um, statues for today, and a rename. 
um, for one of the knitters of last episode, Knitter Queen or Knitter King, it's one of them we're going to be renaming today. Um, but also before we go on with the video, don't forget to hit that like button guys if you enjoyed this series, as I hope most of you do. Uh, the likes really, really do help and, uh, you know, they, 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 you know, I like getting them. They make me feel a little warm and fuzzy. So, uh, don't forget to leave a like, let's try and hit 150, that's pretty easy, pretty within our reach. Uh, I don't like setting the like goals too high, so 150 likes, that would be great. Speaking of, uh, you know, setting high like goals, um, I just want, you know, because I'm bored, I'm telling, I'm telling, you know, we're talking here and we're just waiting for a gloom to show up. I'm pretty sure they show up here, wait, let me open this real quick. But, um, the first episode in this series, season 3, episode 1, I asked, I think, for like 200 likes, and it may be one of my most liked videos of all time. Oh, whoa, 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 I'm gonna try and cut that out, but right now I can hear myself. It might show up in my microphone, I don't know. But if I order my videos from most viewed, it's actually up there somewhere. It's got like 60-something thousand views. Uh, 73 actually, and has 2,555 likes as I'm recording this. I asked for 200, <laughs> so that's pretty insane. Um, I just thought that was something funny. Oh, maybe Gloom spawn in here, where, okay, I've got the wiki open. Oh god, planes, alright, let me move my thingy over. Okay, so we got planes. Sunflower Plains, Swampland, Swampland M, Jungle, Jungle Hills, Jungle Edge, Jungle M, Jungle Edge M, Roof Forest, Roof Forest M, Flower Forest. Alright, so they spawn, they don't spawn in normal forests, but they do spawn in these roofed forests. And between, oh, it's only at dawn and dusk. That's a little bit disappointing. Well, what we could do is just catch an Oddish and evolve it through levels. It evolves at level, um, it doesn't actually say. Why doesn't it say what level it evolves? Hmm, alright, let me, it doesn't even say that it evolves from a bell sprout. I mean, not a bell sprout, sorry, an Oddish. Alright, let's just catch this Oddish right here. Should be pretty easy, it's like only level 6. Hey, don't you run from me! I will, I will turn you into a Gloom. You will be the best Dan Gloom this, oh. Oh, okay, we, I didn't, I didn't heal my, uh, my Altaria. So it has no PP in Sing, that is a fun time, alright. Let's see, I mean, it's a level 6 Oddish, it shouldn't be that difficult. Okay, come on, come on, bag, Ultra Ball. If I throw a Master Ball at this thing, I'm gonna be so pissed. I'm gonna cut it, I, I would seriously cut it out of the video, spawn in a new one, and forget it ever happened. Because that's like too much for me to handle if I just waste a Master Ball on an Oddish. Mm. Okay. Um, alright, we have the Oddish. Let's bring him out and train him a little bit. It's gonna be, it's gonna be super easy to train him. Um, okay, let's get rid of this. And, alright. So, wait, ooh, 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 EXP share, okay, that'll make things easy. Yep, alright. So, where are we gonna go? We just need high-level Pokemon. And Rico, Rico can do all the work. I still like training Rico because I want him to get, like, higher level, but it just takes so darn long for him to level up now. Because there's no Pokemon that are anywhere near his, like, level range. We just don't get anywhere near enough experience. Alright, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20. Stun Spore, yes. Sleep Powder, yes. Let's just give him all the powders. Alright, so he's up to level 20. It can't be too many more levels now to evolve him. See, this is how, this is how easy it is, though. Hello, order Caterpies. Caterpies, Caterpies how you doing? Um, what else have we got? Uh, Pidgeotto. You're only level 17. Oh, I see an Arbok, though. Come here, Arbok. I got you. I got you. I'm coming for you. I'm coming for you, Arbok. Alright, what level's you? 28? Oh, come on, dude. I thought you, you could be, like, level 40, but no, you choose to be level 28. 21, Mega Drain. Get rid of Absorb. Oh, that was it. We only needed one more level. Alright. Awesome. Thank you. Alright, so we're getting... We got our Gloom. The sun is setting, so we can start heading over and trying to catch this uh, Clefairy, which I think it spawns at... Dawn, dusk, and night. So now that it's getting to dusk, slash night, uh, we should be able to try and find a Clefairy right now. Which is good. And if we can, we'll try and catch two. I mean, I don't think it'd be too difficult to catch two. Let's just grab this. Premier Ball! Nice. Uh, Alright. So if we go... I, I want to go home first because I want to heal uh, my Nimbus so it can actually sing. And, uh, alright, let me, let me just eat as well. And we'll make a bunch of Ultra Balls now, because we planned this in advance, because we are smart. And by we, I mean me. I am smart. I did this. You guys are just watching me. Watching me be smart. Okay. Um, but without you guys, I wouldn't be making this, which means I wouldn't be smart, so thank you. Where are we? This way. We're going this way. Da-da-da. 
<sighs> All right, uh, Clefairy, where are you, baby? Baby Clefairy. No, there actually is a baby Pokemon of Clefairy, isn't there? Or maybe, oh no, wait, there's Iggly, Igglytuff, or Iggly Buff. One of, there's something like that for Jigglypuff. Baby Clefairy, yeah, there is. It's, um, I can't think of it right now. Isn't there? Oh, I don't know, I'm getting confused. Someone will probably comment it down below. All right, Skarmory. We don't actually have a... Sk While we're here, we may as... Oh, Hitmonchan. <gasps> we need to Hitmonchan. That's Gen 1 right there. That's, that's some Gen 1 shit. All right. So we'll just try and catch whatever shows up here that we haven't caught already. Uh... Bu 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 bubble Beam. Don't kill it. Ooh. Um, uh, Bubble Beam. Ah, oh, shit. All right. It's super effective. What? How is water super effective? Against a fighting type, uh, Mega Drain. We already okay, whatever. Just them Pixelmon glitches. Um, mm, nothing yet. I need another Hitmonchan. I made a mistake there. Also, I meant to throw out Nimbus, but I didn't. Um, no, nothing. All right, let's just keep on walking down. It's a plains. Is it a plains biome or extreme hills? I think it's still in extreme hills. All right. That'll still work. I'm pretty sure Clefairy only spawns in Extreme Hills. Crawdaunt, Drowsy. Pretty sure we have a Drowsy and a Hypno. Don't we have both of them? Uh. Oh, we don't have a, we don't have a Drowsy. We only have a Hypno. All right, let's catch a Drowsy. Unless he despawned, which it looked like he did. All right, well, no more Drowsy. But if we see another Drowsy, we know to catch him. Uh, Geodude. All right, Clefairy, where are you? It is it is pitch black. It is time for you to spawn. Geodude. Geodude, Geodude. Shuckle. No one likes you, Shuckle. Come on, give me Clefairy. Why isn't it giving me the Clefairy? What's going on here, guys? Someone, uh, someone tell me what's going on. See, whenever we try and look for a Pokemon, it never spawns. And then when we're not looking for it, it'll, like, it'll spam me. It'll be, like, everywhere. We'll catch the Clefairy. And we'll get the Clefable, and then we'll just be, like, confronted by a pack of them. That we won't need anymore. Because that's just, that's how this game works. This game works by screwing you over. That's what it does, you know. Just Geodudes and Shuckles everywhere. Ooh, is that Snorlax? That is a, no, it's not. It's a Clefairy. Why did I, why did, in my head, I saw a Snorlax? All right, but we got the Clefairy. Is that a Clefable in the background as well? Well, let's do this. All right, sing. All right, sing. Let's put it to sleep first. Then I want to do a little bit of damage. Dragon Breath. All right, Dragon Breath. And then that might paralyze it as well if we get... No, it didn't. All right. But it is asleep and low health. Let's Premier Ball it. Why not? Let's just use that Premier Ball. Also, we should, probably should have made Dusk Balls, but that's it's fine. Neither here nor there. All right. There we go. We caught a Clefairy. There's one down. Um, now, I swear I saw another Clefairy or Clefable or something. But again, they just seem to despawn. De Do I have a Snorlax? No, all right, we need to catch a Snorlax as well. All right. Okay, there's a Snorlax all the way over there. Uh, we'll also try and catch a Sableye and a Skarmory if we get time. Um, and then if we catch a Sableye, we're gonna kill any of them that, kill any Sableye that we see afterwards because they have a chance of dropping, um, dropping diamonds. Oh my God, he takes so much damage. Peck, and he has sleep talk, which is so not fair. Peck. Oh god, all right, what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna swap out to Salamander, because I don't care if Salamander dies. So we're gonna go Slash. Okay, nope, Flame Burst. And he put himself to sleep, which is actually useful. Flame Burst, Flame Burst, Flame Burst, Flame Burst, Slash. And I think he's asleep. I don't know, but we're gonna use an Ultra Ball anyway. He has next to no health, but Snorlax is so hard to catch. It'd probably be easier for us to try and catch a Munchlax and then evolve that. Uh, okay, he still hasn't healed, but it's like any move now, he's gonna just like go to sleep and heal. Which means we're just gonna have to get him low all over again. Like Snorlax has crazy amounts of health. Okay, sleep talk was pointless because you're not asleep, buddy. And I do see a Golbat in the background, which means we should probably catch that. And tackle, oh my god, that did a lot of damage. If he kills Salamander, we'll send out um, uh, our um, Alteria. Try and put him back to sleep. Wasting a lot of Ultra Balls. He'll get, he'll get caught at some point. We got this, don't worry. 
And then once we catch a Snorlax, you know, yes! Oh, no, damn. <laughs> I thought we caught him. All right, sing. Yes, he's asleep. He's asleep with no health. All right, this is a better circumstance. We might be able to get him now. We might be able to get him. If I had a Dusk Ball, it'd, it'd probably be a lot easier. No. Okay, he woke up again. Let's put him back to sleep. No! Oh my god. It's gonna take forever to try and beat this guy. And he killed me. Alright, let's go Aurora. You got this. Ice Beam. Yeah. Yeah, now you're gonna die. But don't die, because we need you alive so we can, you know, try and catch you. Ugh. Ugh. I'm, I don't care. I'm gonna waste all my Ultra Balls on this guy. Actually, oh, maybe we shouldn't. Okay, I'm gonna waste... Uh, three more. We're gonna get down to five Ultra Balls. If we still don't catch him, Aurora's just gonna kill him. And he'll probably go up a level as well. Alright, let's throw another one. Snorlaxes are hard to catch. Oh my god. I didn't even realize how hard they were to catch. Last one. Alright, here we go. Here we go. This is it, guys. This is it. We're gonna get a little Snorlax. Snorlax, Snorlax, Snorlax. Oh my god, it actually worked! The last Pokeball we're gonna use actually caught the Snorlax. That's awesome! Alright. Uh, Alright, let's get this Snorlax. We're gonna go down to... What number are you? You are right near the end, aren't you? 143. Yup. So, right up here. So, what are you? 140, 141, 142, 143. Right there. Look at that. Um, and then Gloom as well. Oh, we're gonna have to take this off of you before we put you in here. So Gloom, you go there, and also Clefairy, you go there. So we're going to need another Clefairy, though, so we can get that Clefable. Oh, what's that over there? What is that? What is that? It is a Clefairy. A very high level, and we don't have Sing. So this could be an issue. But why do I still have Nemo on me? I don't even use Nemo. All right, never mind. We'll, we'll figure it out. Uh, Ice Beam. Okay, we killed it. That was not good. All right, let's... um. Let's set a waypoint here real quick. New and extreme kills. Save it. We're going to teleport home. We're going to heal real quick before the sun rises completely. All right. Then we're going to grab these two out. Oh, no, wait. We can't make any more Ultra Balls. I'm out of the bottom bit. Okay, that's fine. We have five. Hopefully that's enough. Extreme heals. Teleport back. Um, mm, Geodude, Trainer, Geodude, Geodude, uh, Shuckle, Geodude, Geodude, Starly. Mm, oh, Clefable. Clefable. Okay, there we go, there we go, here we go. Here we go, there we go, here we go, there we go. Hey, come on, come on. Okay, wait, wait, wait. I just don't want it to despawn, that's why I'm freaking out. Okay, uh, Dragon Breath. Ooh, that did damage. Alright, Peck. Okay, good, 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 good. Sing. Alright, now, Ultra Balls. Come on, let me catch this Clefable, then I don't have to waste a Moonstone. And also, that means, you know, a new Pokemon in the, po in the living decks. Oh, come on, don't wake up. And don't slap me. Are you kidding me? Why would you slap me? That's so rude. What, you slap my, my bird. Why are you slapping birds? That's the code word for today. I'm going to make that the code word today. Bird slapping. I'll type it out officially so you guys can type it out, but you know, it's like, bird slapping. God damn, that's so rude. All right, come on, come on. Just make like the Snorlax did and get in that ball. Ah, come on. Sing. Sing. All right, we have two more. Here we go, 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 here we go. Here we go, here we go, here we go, here we go, here we go. Oh my god. Alright, we're not going to catch this Clefable, it looks like. But we did get one of them. I might try and get this one off camera, actually. I do pretty much all of my catches on camera, but if we don't get it right now, I might do this one... Yeah, I'm going to do this one off camera, just because we would already tried to get it, and it just didn't get in. So I'm going to do this one off camera later on, because we have to wait till nighttime and everything to try and get it as well. So, um, but yeah. Uh, I think, how long are we? We might need to end this episode soon, especially because I'm doing daily, they might be a little bit short, uh, not daily, sorry, but every other day, um, I'm doing them very often, so we might have to make these episodes a little bit shorter, but let's just go home, 
Um, nearly made a statue there. Oh, we have we have statues to do. Completely forgot. All right, let's throw this baby. Uh, where do you go? One thirty. Okay. That means you should be somewhere around here. Uh, one hundred eight. Wait, what? One hundred eight to one. Th oh wait, yeah, no, this one goes like over here. Wait, what number are you? One twenty-five. Six, seven, eight, nine. Oh my god, I had it in like the right place. It was there. Okay, cool. Alright, so that's where Gyarados is. We do need another magic card, but that's fine. We can get that later on. Uh, so Clefable will go there. We need a Vulpix, which, I mean, uh, we need another Vulpix and then evolve it with a Firestone? Or is it actually level? I don't know, but it shouldn't be too difficult. Then uh, we need a Zubat as well. What goes there? Um, uh, da -da -da. Oh, Jigglypuff and Wigglytuff go there. Alright, so I, th I think we can get actually, I'm going to try, next episode, we're going to try and get all of these. So we're going to try and get Clefable, although I might do that off camera. We're going to need Ninetales, Jigglypuff, Wigglytuff, and Zubat. And then, ooh, didn't I want to level up the Growlithe enough before we, because I really want to, ah, oh, no, that's fine. We'll just get an Arcanine. Arcanine will be easy as well. Okay, we got we got a lot of Pokemon ahead of us, but we're, ma we're making good time. I like it. Alright, let's go make these fan statues real quick. Ooh, and I'm gonna bring along, uh, you, okay, let's bring you along, because I, guess what, if you didn't pick up, I'm gonna be renaming the Nidoqueen today, that is gonna be the rename for today, um, and I'll do it, I'll do the, a statue, ooh, we're out of space for statues, okay, okay, well, what we're gonna do here, actually, is we're gonna chop this out, uh, I have a pallet on me, oh, I only have one pallet on me, though, Ooh, this isn't gonna be good. All right, I'll fix this up later. Whoever becomes the statue, I'll fix this up later. Don't worry. But um, our first statue of the day is Blazon Phoenix. Ooh, wait, did I spell that right? Did I spell Phoenix right? Is that how you spell Phoenix? Phoenix. Oh, it's O E. All right. Okay. All right. There we go. I nearly didn't make you into a statue because I spelt your name wrong. I'm stupid. All right. And then you would go here. Congratulations to our second fan statue of the episode. It is Ash523. Bam. Sculpt that baby. Now, we don't have a palette, but I'm going to go see if we can make one. And uh, and then uh, we won't do signs because I can't, I can't be bothered doing signs lately. Like, it's just, like, so much effort, especially because I did some stupid design on it. That's just, like, it's so tedious. Um, but let's see what sort of dyes and stuff we have. Oh, whoops. Um, okay, nothing in there. Alright, we got Lapis, we got Rose Red. We don't have any of the green stuff. Um, and to get the green stuff, we need Cactus and whatever. Uh, okay, I'm gonna do you- I'm gonna do some- try and do some stuff off-camera. So, that'll be- that'll be one of the off-camera things. Um, let's see. I'm just looking at the items and stuff that we have. Alright, uh, and in here we'll put away the Hyper Potion, we'll put away the Ether. And that's it. That's it, alright. Ooh, bam. Ooh, bam. Ooh, bam, bam. Ooh, uh, I'm just putting away some stuff. Uh, button. Uh, sugar cane. Bam, 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 bam. Bam, Oh, oh, that's out of space. Okay. Bam, bam. And bam, bam. Awesome. Okay, I'm gonna end this episode here, I think. I think it's a good time. Oh, no, wait, we didn't rename the Nidoqueen. Okay, Nidoqueen's name. Congratulations to Lloyd and Crafter, who gave us the name Elizabeth, in reference to Queen Elizabeth, because Nidoqueen is, like, you know, Nidoqueen. So, Nida, Queen Elizabeth. Makes sense. I like it. So, congratulations, uh, Lloyd and I liked it. Good job. And, uh, lastly, if you guys didn't pick it up before, I said I was gonna type it out. Kind of forgot. Code word for today is... Bird, and I'm gonna go ahead and say, I mean, people might have done it like this. I'm gonna go ahead and type it like this. Bird slapping. You gotta do that little, like, thing as well. If you want, we can, uh, we can make it capitalized as well. We can go bird slapping, and then put that there. Bam! So that's the code word for today. Comment it down below if you guys watched all the way through this video. Don't forget to leave a like down below as well. If you guys enjoyed the video, hopefully you did. Uh, leave a comment down below, as I said, with the code word. Uh, don't forget to leave a comment as well with your Minecraft username so you become a fan statue. And then also leave a nickname uh, for any Pokemon that have not yet got a nickname. And then lastly, don't forget to subscribe for more Pixamon Minecraft gaming and all that goodness. And I will see you guys on the next episode of Pixamon Season 3. Bye!